Andy Hillier and today I'm going to teach you the new song by Harry Styles called She. Uh, it's probably my favourite one off the new album. Uh, it's a relatively easy song to play uh, and it's pretty much the same chords all the way through but there's a couple of little variations. Uh, so I'm going to teach you that little strumming pattern as well. Uh, while I think of it, if you could subscribe to my channel which is Andy Hillier, uh, give me a like on this video and get some comments in the comment section down below. Any other uh, songs that you want me to learn uh, or do a video of, put them in the comment section down below and I'll try and do a video for you. Okay, so let's get started with um, She. Uh, standard tuning, uh, the first chord we need is an E minor chord, which is just A2 and D2, hitting all the strings. Um, now, this next chord is different in the intro as it is every other time it goes round. Uh, it plays this weird chord. Uh, I don't know what we'll call that, it's kind of like um, a D minor with uh, a sixth in it. D minor sixth, I suppose. Yeah, that works. Okay, anyway, all we need to do is put our first finger on E1 and our second finger on G2 and just play the bottom four strings. So that's D minor six. Okay, uh, and that's gonna do that for two bars. Um, this is in six, eight, so it's like one, two, three, four, five, six in every bar. So you've got two bars of E minor, two bars of this D minor six chord. Uh, then we've got C major seven, which if you play the C chord, it's the same, just without the first finger on. So you've just got your second finger on A2 and third finger on A3. So second finger D2, third finger A3. That's C major seven. Uh, the second last chord we need is an A minor seven, which is just your first finger on B1, second finger on D2. And the final chord, again, this chord is slightly different uh, in the intro as it is to the rest of the song. We've got a B7 sharp uh, nine with a flat 13. Sounds confusing, bit of a jazzy chord, which is your first finger on D1, second finger on A2, third finger on G2, and your little finger across the E and the B strings at the third fret. And you get that cool jazzy chord, the B7 sharp 9 flat 13. Okay, so let's play those chords. Uh, so this is the chords for the intro. Uh, it's going to go one. And if you want to put a bit of rhythm, we could go. So for that, I'm just kind of going down, up, down, up, down, down, down. So that kind of feel, you can put some extra ones in, but... Um, okay, so let's go then on to the next part. Now there's only two others, well, there's, there's three more parts that I need to show you. Um, there's only a tiny light, little variation. Um, so let's go through this one. Uh, it, it does this for the first time. So it's E minor for a bar, or two bars. And then it goes to this kind of D minor seven um, chord, but it hasn't actually got the flattened th um, third in it. So all we need to do is hold uh, your first finger on B1 and your second finger on um, G2. And we're just going to play those three strings. And then in the next bar, it just goes to E3 with your third finger. So it plays the chord. And it just changes the root note to that three. So you don't have to play the rest of the chord again. Uh, and then the rest of the bar is almost, or the rest of the line is almost the same. It goes C major seven, uh, A minor seven, and then that last chord. I just haven't got that flat thirteen on the top, so I've just got uh, the E seven sharp nine, which is your first finger on D one, second finger on A two, third finger G two, little finger just on the B string this time, not on the B and the E on fret three. Okay, so let's play that line. One, two, three, four, five, six. OK, 
Okay, now a, a slight variation on that. It's exactly the same, only you can see there in bar four, we don't go down to this E3 in the bass, like the G in the bass on bar four. It just keeps that same sort of D minor seven chord uh, for the whole bar. So let's play that line. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. Now there's only one little variation um, after the first chorus. It plays E minor for two bars, and then straight to A minor seven to that E seven sharp nine chord. So let's just quickly try that. A one, two, three, four, five, six. And then it goes back. So it. Um, you just got to watch out if you hear when it goes down to the like the G in the fourth bar. That's the only variation really on it. Apart from that, it goes around the same chords. So there you go. That's She by Harry Styles. Lovely little song. Not too hard to play. Hopefully you've enjoyed this little video. If you have, if you could subscribe to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, I'd really appreciate that. If you could give me a like on this video uh, and some comments. Let me know what you think of the video. If you've enjoyed it, if you've hated it. Uh, any songs you'd like to learn uh, and you want me to do a video on, that'd be awesome as well. Thanks for watching this. I've been Andy Hillier and I'll see you next time.